Hey, hello. Thank you for coming for my senior capstone proposal presentation. Uh, so for my proposal, my subject is going to be based around how do current social media algorithms hurt or help independent artists build a following online today? So just a little bit about myself before we get into the actual content of the presentation. My name is Aracelis. I did transfer from the Word Community College after getting my associates in digital media. I also graduated from James Campbell High School. And so now I'm here currently at UH West Oahu wanting to get my bachelor's in creative media with my concentration being in the general creative media program. So an overview for my presentation, I'll be going over my plans for my senior capstone project, my thesis statement, the rationale for my research, as well as the significance of my project and my research. To get started, my thesis statement is that it's imperative that creators should be competent with marketing skills in order to combat the whims of publicly traded social media companies and their secretive platforms. And the rationale behind this is that by doing this research, what I'm hoping to do is to help educate other artists such as myself on how to best take advantage of social media platforms and what they offer in terms of marketing and having access to a large worldwide audience and specifically looking into just what marketing skills and strategies that these artists can obtain in order to further their chances of success to market themselves and share their works online. For my actual senior capstone project, um, I'll be moving forward with a project and I'll be building a website. And the purpose of this website is to hopefully act as a resource for these independent artists to learn about how beneficial social media can be, first of all, as well as seeing success stories from other artists who have started um, from square one, just as them, to see how they have gotten to where they are now, and especially covering the marketing skills and strategies that they should consider implementing in their business endeavors as they post on social media to market themselves. Moving into the significance of this, uh, the first thing that I would like to note is that social media has quickly developed into a popular form of marketing for many companies and even small businesses, as it essentially allows them free access to billions of potential customers worldwide. Um, with the growth that's been happening, online users will also grow and become active on social media platforms within the next few years which in turn increases the total number of potential customers that these marketers can um, reach online. And so this is one of the graphs that essentially show that social media platforms are being increasingly used by marketers worldwide. Um, the top three can be noted as Facebook, Instagram, and LinkedIn. For this case, I'll be looking specifically at Instagram as uh, that is one of the more popular platforms for visual artists to use to share their works. Marketers uh, make use of Instagram by 79% as reported by this graph. And then to further prove the usefulness of Instagram, um, they're estimating a substantial growth of their uh, regular and active users. Back in 2021, they reported 1.21 billion active users. And within the next four years, they're expecting to see an uprise of users to 1.44 billion users by 2025. So this just goes to show how this is an increasing market that small businesses and independent artists can take advantage of. Which brings me to my next point that although social media does provide to be a useful tool and an access to this large audience, Research has shown that many artists and small businesses lack the marketing skills they need in order to properly take advantage of these platforms and gain the engagement that they're looking for. And without these property marketing skills, it essentially sets them back from taking full advantage of this growing and accessible market from social media. And then the next point is that social media algorithms as well provides a problem for these small artists um, as the social media algorithms will put first new features, which are being seen as um, beneficial business ventures for the platform themselves rather than for the users, which can make it harder for these creators to effectively reach their audiences as algorithms aren't immediately known, the changes aren't immediately known until it's actually implemented. And so because of this struggle, it can 
eventually turn away both current and new social media users from actually using these platforms to market themselves due to the unpredictability of the algorithm, despite how useful of a tool it can be. And so who I'm keeping in mind for this project is basically small and independent artists who are building their online profiles and trying to sell their work online. Uh, it can cover both old and current users who have already been posting on the internet for a while now with their own following, and they're just looking to see in what ways they can improve their social media strategies, or new users who don't entirely have the knowledge or background on how to start posting on social media and have an interest in that. So they can be defined between being digital natives, those who have already been posting, or businesses with little to no social media presence. And so for my website, what I'm hoping to do is that it'll bring a solution by acting as a resource for these artists to learn at least general information of what marketing skills and strategies they can use to take full advantage of social media, while also covering other topics, such as the benefits of social media and the success stories of other artists, as I mentioned earlier before. In terms of preparation and process for my project, um, before production, I'll have to do research on finding a fitting website builder that has the tools that I'll need in order to properly uh, display and implement the text information, any media pieces I'll be putting in, whether it's images, videos, or photographs, um, and concluding any final research that may be beneficial to include into the overall marketing skills section and creating mock-ups for the website design itself, which will also in turn help influence filtering which website builder will ultimately be the best option. Um, production will most likely take most of the time during the semester as I'll have to figure out how to divide the information into separate pages. Generally, I know that there will be the landing page with general information to introduce um, viewers of the website, what the purpose of the website is, um, benefits page to cover the benefits of social media, marketing page to cover marketing skills and strategies, and then the success story page. Um, and then production will also include writing out the information, making sure that they can be in understandable and bite-sized pieces while still getting the information across to these artists who are wanting to learn more about social media and its benefits and marketing skills as well as finding and creating the visual medias to accompany the text. And then once the actual website itself is completed, it'll just be a matter of figuring out how to share the website among these circles of artists so that it can actually become a resource for them to look towards and read up on to gain that information of marketing skills and strategies, and also potentially updating the information as time goes on so that it remains relevant as social media and its algorithms are constantly updating. And then these are just a couple examples of what the deliverable could look like um, in terms of like images. I want to go for something really simple, but something engaging um, just so that there's not really any distracting visuals that will pull away from the text itself, but while still being able to maintain the audience's attention. And then other than that, that will conclude my presentation for my senior capstone project. Thank you for listening. And if you have any questions, I'm more than happy to answer them.